Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Xanthus Gaming. We're here in Seven Days to Die, and we're going to be continuing our insane playthrough. Wow. Thank you. I have to repair that club, aren't I? Cutting it just a little bit close here. We'll be fine though. Cool. GTFO. Actually, before it's runtime, let's cook ourselves some bacon eggs. cooking pot in for fuel. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? One minute, 15 seconds. It's gonna be tight, but I think we'll be fine. I don't think I need the paint. I'm just gonna drop that. Lead is a dime a dozen. Eat the pasta, clear up the inventory spot, replace it with bacon eggs. Done. Done. We're gonna put the beer on the bar, so we'll probably end up using it during the night. Maybe. Definitely need to keep the small stones on the bar. Coffee can go on the bar instead of arrows. Excellent. Let's get a little extra full. And... We're still slightly encumbered. I think this is the point where we invest our first point into pack mule. Just kidding. Why did I think I had a point available? Did I put it? Oh, I put it into charging bowl. That's right. Well, we almost got another level. Do we have a monster we can kill real quick? Or a zombie, rather? There's one. And you guys might not be able to see it, but it's there. Even if I miss it terribly. I think I need to get a little closer. Oh my god, I missed again? I aggroed him still somehow. Alright, here we go. Oh! See? This is why I shouldn't take that perk. I'm so tempted to use charging strikes, it costs me more than it's worth heal up with the uh, bacon eggs it's gonna put us way over full but I'd rather do that and get healed back up and not die there it is then have a little extra hunger maximum or uh, optimization I guess uh, scrap that and I think we're just going to leave the coffee beans on the campfire. We'll come back this way later. Put some frames in so we know where it is. We've got a zombie on our right. We could fight her. I think we would be pretty darn successful. We also have a deer ahead of us. I'm definitely going to want to kill that deer. As a result... I think I'm going to go for her. We make 11 sound while walking, huh? If we just sit here, will she come to us? This is the test if that talent was worth it. Trying to decide where to path to next. Or is she detecting us right now? We haven't moved. 
Now we have. The rain is bouncing off of us, so we're a little bit louder than we were a second ago. Noise! He dropped sight of us? Nope! He did not. Okay! <laughs> Nothing exciting going on here, guys. Nothing to worry about. <clears throat> oh, jeez. Alright. Well. Nighttime will be interesting. One kilometer more. Ooh. We're low enough on health. I don't know if this is a wise idea to do this. Can we shoot her and then move? Apparently we can. Oh, just kidding. Oh my god. Alright. Let's get away from her. Holy crap. Tempting fate. I forgot to take the cooking pot back off the campfire. Well. We are definitely going to have to go back for that. What the f- Apparently I tripped over a chrysanthemum. There's, there's literally nothing there. Apparently you just occasionally trip over your own feet. Uh, it looks like there's a mine right behind the trader. We're gonna have to hit that up as well. Or is that a graveyard? I think that's a mine. We'll have to hit that on the way back. And there's a mine right to the side of us right now, actually. There's usually quite a few zombies hanging out around mines. So we're going to hold off until daytime. To be honest, I should just... I should eat right now and restore some of that health. I think that's wise. Go that way, please. Yeah. Cool. Glad we figured out that that works. So attracted to sound. Like, pretty directly attracted to sound. move him in the opposite direction of where we are. Don't trip on a chrysanthemum now.
That guy's going the opposite direction. It doesn't look like we have to worry about him. I hear one over there, too. Yep. No, nope, no, nope. go the other direction. Okay, she's by the tree now, over there. Definitely glad I took the In the Shadows perk to be able to make like progress during the night like this and feel semi-safe about it. I actually don't know why I did that. That was really dumb. Okay, he didn't notice that. That brought our detection up to 20. Don't loot bird's nest during the night. Apparently picking feathers out of a nest is super loud. Just so you know. How far are we from our treasure chest? We've made good progress. This is where we started in the evening. We've made good progress. All right, and we are safe. It is now daytime. Let's kill some zombies. I don't know how that didn't hit her, but there we go. Second one in exactly the same spot did. I wonder if it counts the running backwards for the extra damage. All right, 